me. <laughs> Shiny wet off the paper. You don't want shiny wet. Shiny wet. Is and the honey really does yeah, not depart terribly low, terribly low soap. And what I like to do with towels is I like to I like to destroy them by cutting the Hilton sign off it. <laughs> if you have embroidery, just cut that off because this doesn't work the same way as this, one, this part does. So that is very important to all to know. So this is a real fun part. They're not nice. And they'll flatten out in the press. Now this is a um, press that used to belong to a woman by the name B.B. Duché. She lived in Massapequa, and she had this press, it was very big at the time. She used to have this going right out her window. Her room was too small, so she had it in between her two rooms, and she'd have this part go right through the window. And that was, it was the, and it was built by a guy by the name of Joe Martin, and it's called a Martech Press. It happens to be motorized, and you don't want to see that. That'll hurt you. Dan, do you want newsprint to cover that? No, uh, we, we don't have to because, no, okay. but uh, we could, ju just want to get this out of the way so we're not, thank you very much. Um, what I'm going to do is catch this. Can you tell us what kind of paper that you're using? I did, Lori. This is called a Hanemula. H a h n e m u with the umlaut u h l e Hanna Müller. That's your favorite paper. I like it a lot. Any paper is going to work, but I like this because of the 300 gram uh, R shape. Oh, thank you. So we let this roll down, roll like down, one vertebrae at a time. Right, just like you're doing <laughs> yoga. Right, one vertebrae. At a time. Hmm? Okay. Same with the blanket. A little 
crooked, isn't it? Yeah. We're going to have a crooked yeah, print. Okay. That's really dangerous, I think. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've come home with plenty of black and blue ones. What? I've come home with plenty of black and blue ones. Yeah, it's good thing you know a guy. And there's another switch on this side. And the person who's printed this puts it on. I'm saying, oh, black. Now, you can take that handle off when you're doing this. Can you? The two the of them that I make them I make them crank on their own instead of She's me. <laughs> I want you to feel what it feels like. Why is that slowing down? Sometimes you gotta help it with, yeah, so it doesn't like stall. Alright. Well, we'll see. I think it needs some service in this double it over. And we'll see if that's underneath. Let's go a little bit more. So this is nothing now. Whoops, I'm going to peel it gently. This is a background color. And what we're going to try to attempt to do is... Which one? Yeah, do you have any magnets here or anything? My magnets are on the farm. So those of you that can see, what we're doing is we're putting this in direct contact with the square part of the plate. So that is important because what's going to happen is we're going to remove, you got it? Yep. We're going to remove this plate. You want me to hold the, hold this while you move? Okay, we'll get this out of here. You can just leave it. Got it. Now, as long as we don't move that, now we're going to replace this plate with the other one. Just place markers, just like, just to remember the spot. So while we're getting this ready, we're going to hold that down. Got that? Got it. Come back to this guy here. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those, yeah, good. Those guys in Provin Provincetown. That's a small. That's a small motor for what it's moving. You could replace that that motor pretty easily. It's a very I have we had like so many of them in my dad's shop. We're gonna pull this plug out so that nobody gets any. Uh, and rather than saying, oh, I'm not sure. Will there be a class limit for that for the living? Probably. Yeah. yeah, we're gonna establish that, and that will be. I mean, there's only so many people. Mm -hmm. that will be. So and Chris yeah. Ann, where are you? Just, yeah. Just as, just did this with me at the East End Arts Council. We did it for four days. And it was a very successful week. People did some really dynamite pieces. Would you say so? Oh, yeah. So, Chris Ann was my assistant there, and she just, uh, you know, she was really in charge. Thank mm -hmm. you. 